Live. Well, we did see plenty of sunshine today, and here's a live look outside of the 720 camera overlooking Purdue University. It is a pleasant evening, but it is a chilly one. You can look off in the distance. We do have clear skies over the region, 31 degrees. Winds from the south-southeast at 9 miles per hour, and with those wind speeds, Temperature actually feels like it's 23 degrees. Now here's a look at the current temperatures around the region. 28 in Kokomo, 30 in Rossville, and currently 33 degrees up in Fowler. But notice there is a freezing rain advisory in place for our northwestern counties, and that will last until 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. And that's because we are tracking freezing rain that will be moving in later tonight. We have a low pressure system over Oklahoma, and eventually a warm front is going to lift into the region. And as a result, we'll have increasing cloud cover during the evening and then eventually those rain showers moving in after midnight tonight. You can see a little bit of pink in that and that will represent the freezing rain. Now we'll keep that chance for freezing rain all during the overnight hours and then transition into rain showers by tomorrow morning. But unfortunately, it looks like those rain chances are going to stick around through Saturday and also into Sunday with a few thunderstorms even possible by Sunday. But what to expect tonight since we do have that threat for three freezing rain, slick roads is a possibility. We're also tracking a soggy weekend, both rain chances for Saturday and Sunday, looking at rain totals anywhere from one to two inches. And then it's also going to be gusty as that strong low pressure system pushes through the region. You can expect wind gusts from the south at around 30 miles per hour. But tonight, temperatures will dip into the mid 20s, lower 20s up to our northern counties, 23 in Winnemac, and then 22 degrees in Remington with wind chill values just around the upper teens. We'll have a wind chill around 18 degrees in Lafayette, 17 Delphi, and then 18 in Logansport. Our low temperature is actually going to occur just around 11 o'clock this evening, but after that warm front does move through the region, you can see temperatures gradually rising during the overnight hours, 34 at 3. And then 37 degrees by 5 o'clock in the morning and still seeing a chance for freezing rain during the early morning hours. Just around 38 degrees tomorrow morning at 8 and then eventually in the 40s with that chance for rain. Highs will be in the mid 40s into the upper 40s by tomorrow afternoon. 46 in Williamsport with a high of 46 degrees in Fowler. Temperatures will gradually rise through the weekend. 51 will be the high Sunday. And then 52 degrees by Monday, but after that system moves through, they're going to plummet once again. 34 on Tuesday, and then rebounding only to 35 by next Wednesday. So here's a look at your seven-day forecast. Unfortunately, it's a soggy weekend. A chance for a few thunderstorms on Sunday with a high of 51 degrees. 52 by Monday, but notice we do dry out a bit by Tuesday. And then looks like there's a chance for snow on Thanksgiving. It'll be nice and warm this week.